Hey guys, in today's video, we're going to see the keyboard shortcuts for working with tables in Microsoft OneNote. So it may happen that you have a lot of tabular data to process and you have to work through the home, insert and draw options many times. So to simplify your process, Microsoft OneNote has come up with some shortcuts. So let's begin. The first shortcut is for creating a table. So you have to press the tab key after typing a new line of text. So let's type in some text, serial number and let's press tab okay so a new column has been created let's insert the name first now if you wish to create another column then you have to press tab again so in this way you can create multiple columns and once you are done creating columns and you need to you know create a row then you have to press enter when you are at the end cell of a table so i'm here and if i press enter then a row will get inserted and then let's type in one let's type in the name as alex and the city as nyc okay now if i press enter again then another row will get added but please note that if your table is completed and you want to finish the table then here at this position you have to press enter again doing so your table will get finished but now here we need to add some data so i'll go back here and press enter Okay, now the next shortcut is to insert a row below the current row. So the shortcut is control plus enter when in a table cell. If I keep on pressing the shortcut, then new rows will get added. Now the next shortcut is to create another paragraph in the same cell in a table. So the shortcut is alt plus enter. So let's type in the second column first. So I'll put here number two, then the name as Bob and the city as LA. If I'm here and if I uh, press Alt plus Enter, then a new paragraph will get added below this line and we can insert more text here. Okay, uh, now the next shortcut is to create a column to the right of the current column in a table. So the shortcut is Control plus Alt plus R. If I press Control Alt R, then a new column will get added to the right side of the name column. Okay, now uh, let's see how to create a row above the current one in a table. So if I wish to add a row above this uh, serial number two row, then I have to place my cursor at the beginning of this row and I have to press enter. So basically a new row has been added. And next shortcut is to create a new cell or a new row. So the shortcut here is the tab key. So what you have to do is you have to be in the last cell of the table and keep on pressing tab. So I'm in the last cell now. If I press tab, then a new row will get added. Okay, now let's see how to delete uh, the current empty row in a table. So if you wish to delete a row, make sure your cursor is at the beginning of the row and press delete. Then delete again. So this is how you can delete empty rows in your table. So that's it for today guys, hope you find this video useful. Don't forget to check out our other Microsoft OneNote keyboard shortcut videos and do subscribe to our channel. See you guys in the next video. Thank you.